To connect Google Search Console with your Squarespace website, click on Settings, Connected Accounts, and then the button Connect Account. Then select Search Console. It'll open a pop-up block asking you to sign in to your Gmail. If you don't have a Google account, you'll need to create one. You'll need to accept the terms and conditions and then click Allow. Once you allow Google Search Console to share data with Squarespace Analytics, you will see the data indexed in about 72 hours, they say. But if you click see search analytics, if your site is small, sometimes you'll see it within the same day. Once you've connected your Squarespace website with Google Search Console, you'll want to log in to Google Search Console by going to search.google.com forward slash search dash console. Click on site maps found on the left nav bar. Then next to your domain name, you'll type in sitemap.xml. Then click Submit. A sitemap is a blueprint of your entire website, ensuring that Google can find and crawl your key web pages. So this is an important aspect of launching your website. Next, we're going to index your site. This basically tells Google that you want your website to display in search results. Your website won't be invisible if you don't do this part, but it's best practice to index your site once you've published it. In the top search bar, type in your website's URL. Then click Enter. To request indexing, click the option to the right, Request Indexing. Great. Now the sitemap has been added and we've indexed the site, so it's ready to go on Google Search.